In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install Minecraft shaders on Minecraft Java Edition. This video was suggested by McChicken497. So to get things started, you're going to want to open up your favorite web browser. I'm going to be using Google Chrome and you're going to want to have two tabs open like this. In your first one, you're going to want to search for Optifine and then in your second one, you're going to want to load up your shader pack. I already know which shader pack I'm going to be using. I'm going to be using the Sonic Ethers Real Renewed Shader Pack or whatever it's called. So we'll just search in, you know, Minecraft Sonic Ether Shader and go back to Optifine. We want to click on this link here. This is the Optifine website. It should look like this. Head over to Downloads and then you'll see this page. If you want to find more Minecraft Optifines, just press this button here and you'll see all of the different versions. If your version is higher than the one you're playing right now, click on this button here and you'll see the preview versions for that specific version if there are any. However, we're just going to download the latest version of Optifine, which just so happens to be this version right here, Optifine HD UG6. So let's go ahead and press mirror or you can press download, but that will take you to an ad website. So I recommend pressing mirror unless you want to support the developer. So let's go ahead and do that. And that's going to take us to this page. Just press the download button and that will download right down here. There is a chance that your web browser will say that this is a malicious file. Trust me, it's not. Just press keep or allow and then continue on. Now that Optifine's finished downloading, you want to go back to your shader page and download the shaders. I'm going to be choosing this one right here and I'm just going to press download on here. I'm going to accept everything and then I'm going to press the download button that's here. Just remember, you don't have to use the exact same shaders that I'm showing in this video. Use whatever shader pack you like and you think looks good. Anyway, as I've just done there, click on the Optifine and then this window will show up. What you want to do is make sure it's in your correct Minecraft directory and press install. Then Optifine's going to install and bring up this message here, which which means it's installed. So yeah, now we're ready to reopen Minecraft. So as you always do, open up Minecraft. I'm going to do it through start menu and blank screen, blank screen, blank screen. We're back. Minecraft launch is loading. And now all you need to do is click on this button right here. And what this will do is bring up a list and you'll see Minecraft versions you've installed. We're going to click on this Optifine version. It will just be called Optifine for you. However, I have renamed it. So yeah, we'll click on that. And if you'd like to rename it, go to installations, click on the Optifine and then just rename it right about here. So yeah, we're going to do this and we are going to play it just by clicking right there. And we may as well get the shader pack installed once Minecraft launches. So do your start menu, do percent update percent as you've just seen. Go into here, you'll need to make a shader pack folder like I've got here. Go into there, just like this, and then you'll need to go to your downloads file. Once you're inside your downloads file, you will need to drag the shader pack in. Luckily though, you can also get it from Chrome, which is just there. So just click, drag into the folder and release. And there you go. There's your shader pack installed in Minecraft. You're ready to go, which Minecraft has now loaded. So all we need to do from here is go to options, video settings, shaders, and there it is, Zeus Renewed 1.0.1. Click on that. It's going to bring up the Mojang Studios thing and we are ready to go. So when we go ahead and load up a world, what you'll see is everything's going to look rather nice. And we have access to a few other features because we've installed Optifine. So here we go. This is Seuss Renewed version 1.1. Now, obviously, the shaders that you choose will be very different to mine if you choose different ones. So we're going to switch it to this one, which is actually Silders, not Sonic Ethers. But yeah, both great shader packs, Sonic Ethers and Silders. And then, of course, we get the look like this. This is the classic look that you've seen quite a lot in my streams. And you probably notice... I'm zooming. This is an Optifine feature. If you go into your options uh, and then controls all the way down to here, you will see zoom and you can press that. You can do tab. I've got mine set to tab. Hi, Steve. So just for comparison, here's a side by side of Optifine with shaders and Optifine without shaders. Enjoy. <laughs> 